Shrew's birthday party. It's my birthday, it's my birthday. It's the most super epic, totally coolest day. It's Chew's birthday, my best friend's birthday. And I planned a special party for her, yay! I'm gonna see my friends and eat a big birthday cake. Let's get this party started, we don't wanna be late. I'll be a whole year older and it's gonna be great. Bingo, bingo, how's it going? Be there soon. It's Chew's birthday, it's Chew's birthday, and we're gonna drop a birthday beat for you. Got my invite, so excited! Got a present, can't wait! Hey, you Grismos, get my apron! There's a big cake to bake! It's my royal proclamation that we all celebrate! Our favorite person in the kingdom, so let's make her day great! It's my Are you ready for an amazing birthday? Of course. Wait, I still have so much to do for the party tonight. No, you don't. Cuz I planned your whole party. Really? Yep, it's my gift to you. I'm gonna make sure you have the most amazing birthday ever. You won't have to do a single thing today, True. Aw, B, you're the best. I know, but we've got some serious birthdaying to do. Let's get going. It's my birthday. Ready for a treat? I made something extra special. Guess what it is? <laughs> it's you! Yeah! I call them Bartle Biscuits. I got the idea from the mirror. <laughs> hmm. Which part should I eat first? My ears, of course. Good choice. Hey, this kind of tastes like Stranilla. <gasps> Are we having Stranilla cake at my party? You'll have to wait and see. With wiggly jiggly jelly and bubble chew icing? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And as your best friend, I of course knew you'd want all those different flavors together. It's definitely not just a basic mellowberry cake. Aw, uh -huh, Bee. You know me so well. Can I borrow your face bubble thingy for a non-birthday emergency? Sure. Here, have another Bartle biscuit. Try eating it as loud as you can. Uh, loud enough? Griselda, answer my face bubble. Griselda, we have a birthday emergency. <gasps> you ran out of glitter balloons? No, we need to change the mellowberry cake into a straw nilly wiggly jiggly jelly bubble chew icing cake. Oh, that's no problem. Baking isn't hard. All you need is a princess's delicate touch. Uh, uh, uh. But you don't have a recipe. Princesses don't need recipes. We're amazing at everything we do. Right, Grismos? Uh, okay, but don't forget the cake is the most important part of our party. Obvi. That's why I'm in charge of it. Okay, Grismos, you heard Bartleby. Mellowberry's out and Stranella Wiggly Jiggly Jelly Bubble Chew Icing is in. Where's my super fast ever rise powder? Let's add more. More is better. <laughs> Everything good with the decorations? Okay, great. Talk to you soon. Aww. All aboard the Mushroom Town Birthday Express. Hey, yeah! Everyone's on their way? You bet. Right on schedule. Great! Hey, Bingo Bango! You know the way, right? You turn left at the never ending forest? Oh, yeah. Um, okay, I'll take that as a yes. Who's ready for ice cream lunch? Ice cream for lunch? We can do that? Sure, it's your birthday. Let's put the scream in ice cream birthday lunch. Perfect. Ready to bake. Uh, uh. Ugh, what are you girls most doing? Step aside. This needs
needs a princess's delicate touch. <laughs> Baking would be hard if I wasn't so good at it. Okay, Bartleby. I think that's enough. Just one last thing to top it off. A fishy poof cracker. Whoa. Whoa. No. my party. Ah, uh, you weren't gonna wear that anyway. Cuz we're gonna get you a new outfit! Really? But only after you finish all your ice cream. Challenge accepted. No, 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 no. This simply won't do. We need to make it pop. Because all together, more, more is better. better. See? Birthday! 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 Nothing's going to stop this express bus to True's birthday party. Except for this delicious goo. Hey, what's the hold-up? I gotta get to True's party. Pardon me, I have a party to attend. Can you please move it along? Yeah, well, what's going on? Okay, this is perfect. Ready to see my new birthday suit? Is it as cute as mine? <laughs> I love it! In that fabulous outfit, you are going to rock this party. What's that? I don't know, but we better go check it out. What's going on? A traffic jam? Drew's party bus. Oh, hello, Rainbow City bus. Shouldn't you be on your way to someplace very important? Mayhaps? Well, I should, but as you can see... I'm stuck in this delicious goo. It does smell yummy. It is yummy. And it tastes a lot like bubble chew icing. Griselda! Oh. Well, that's wiggly and jiggly enough for a regular cake eater. But this cake needs to be princess level wiggly jiggly. More is better. Hey, Griselda, do you know anything about some bubble chew icing traffic jam? Bartleby, I'm in the middle of making the most important cake of my career. I need my space. I'll talk to you later. But. Toodles! Now, where were we? Ah, yes. Ah! Everything's shaking! Bartleby! Look! The trees! They're falling! <gasps> we need to go see what's going on! But true, we got to, um, uh, what, what about the... Come on, Bartleby. Ah. We'll be right back to help you out. Stay put. I hope all the forest critters are okay. I'm sure the forest critters are fine. You don't really need to do any hero stuff today, do you? I don't know, B, but let's go and check it out anyway. Huh? <laughs> Is everything okay? <laughs> These trees are blocking your path? Hmm. Well, maybe the three of us can move it. Ah, true. Can it wait? We still have that ooey gooey traffic jam to clean up. If we don't help, no one will be able to come through the forest. <laughs> bingo, bingo. Party decorations. We need to move this tree right now. <laughs> That's the spirit. <laughs> This isn't working. Time for some wish help. To the wishing tree. V. Oh, happy birthday, 
true? I, uh, wasn't expecting to see you until your party. The party will have to wait, Z. There was some kind of earthquake. Yeah, we felt it up here, too. It knocked over trees in the never-ending forest, and no one could get around. And there's a sticky situation in Rainbow City. A sticky, gooey situation. And it's causing a huge traffic jam. Oh, that does sound serious. But sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, first we need to get the trees back upright in the never-ending forest. Yeah, and let's not forget, they're super heavy. Then, we have to get the gooey glob off the Rainbow City streets. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> <laughs> wishing tree, share with me. Wait till you see what the Wishipedia says about these. First up is Lifto. Lifto! This wish is incredibly strong. It can lift anything you place on top of it. Just give it a spin. Wow! Lifto, you can help us get all the trees standing again. Lifto! And next we have... Pumpa. This wish can blow air into anything, like a flat tire. Or a balloon bouquet. Pumpa. Or a giant gooey glob like the one causing the traffic jam. Maybe Pumpa can blow it into a bubble and float it away. Pumpa. Oh, you're gonna love this one. Meet Kakaraka, one of the most powerful wishes of all. Kakaraka! Kakaraka is a bursting wish that can help break large things into smaller pieces. Wow! I'm not sure how I can use Kakaraka just yet, but I'm sure it'll be a blast. <laughs> <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. Bye, Z. Good luck, you two. Okay, we're back. Thanks for waiting. Let's see if we can move these trees off the road for you. Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I tune you. Wake up, Lifto. Wish come true. Hey, ho, Lifto. Hey, <laughs> fallen trees? <laughs> we need you to lift them back up again. Which will clear the path and allow everyone to get where they need to go. <laughs> oh, I'm just excited about getting people moving again. Go Lifto! <laughs> Come on back down, Lifto. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's get the rest of this path clear. <laughs> Thanks, Lifto. Now back in the pack. <laughs> Come on, Bee. We've got to get back to Rainbow City to deal with that gooey, globby mess. All this baking is making my lips chapped. Hi. Hi. Oh, what is more important than taking Hi. care of my beautiful skin? Uh-oh. Huh? Hi, everyone. True. Thank goodness. 
I don't think I can eat any more of this delicious goo. Okay, time for my second wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Pumpa. Wish come true. Hi, Pumpa. Pumpa. That giant glob has really gooed up our friends. Ready to help clean it up? Pumpa. Great. I bet we can blow a huge bubble out of that goo. Pumpa power, go! Oh, yay! <laughs> Pumpa! Thanks, Pumpa. That really blew me away. Now back in the back. Thanks, Drew. See you later. You're welcome. Bye! Well, I was hoping you wouldn't need to do any of that hero stuff today, but you took care of that pretty easily. I did, didn't I? Hey, Griselda! Ugh. True! I wish you the most happy birthday! Ugh. Aw! Thanks, Griselda! May I please talk to Bartleby about nothing to do with cakes? Sure thing! <laughs> okay, what is it, Griselda? Bartleby! This cake is not doing what I told it to do. Stay! No! Cake. The words bad and cake are not something I want to hear. What's going on? Well, it turns out more is not always better. The Stronilla cake layer is a bit bigger than I expected. Like, oops, it's so big we're going to be eating cake for a week. More like, oops, it's too big for the oven. And the kitchen. And maybe the house. Ah, come quick, I'm not sure I can hold this much longer. Super huge, totally on purpose birthday cake. B, you shouldn't have. I really shouldn't have. Uh, that'll be for me. Bartleby, the strangest thing just happened. I'm suspended in this scrumptious Stranilla sponge cake. I've been stuck in a traffic jam before, but never a traffic jelly. This cake is going straight to Fergie's obedience school. I Hi, B. Hi, True. Hmm. There might be a small problem with the party. Oh, you mean that giant birthday cake that fell over on Mushroom Town and has all our birthday guests stuck inside the delicious ooey gooey icing? Uh huh. That wasn't part of my plan. True, I hate to ruin your day, but I think I really need your help now. It's okay, B. Helping people is my favorite thing to do. Oh, Cumulo! Hi, Cumulo. We've got a cake problem. To the Mushroom Town. This cake is huge. And it looks delicious, too. Should we just eat our way through? Because I'd be okay with that. Well, as yummy as that sounds, it might take too long. It's time for my third wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Kakaraka. Wish come true. Hi, Kakaraka. We have a giant cake problem. We need your help. Kakaraka! Ready, Kakaraka? Kakaraka! We're rooting for you, Kakaraka. Okay, now wait for my signal. On my count. Three, two, one. Kakaraka! Birthday! 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 Party started! Hey! <laughs> so, I guess we should just leave the party planning to you next year, huh? What do you mean, Bartleby? 
Well, nothing worked out the way I wanted it to. And besides, you don't even have a cake. Bartleby, I had the most incredible day. Mostly because I got to spend it with you. I love the picnic and the ice cream lunch. And I love my outfit. Everything you did today came from your heart. And that made this the best birthday ever. Huh? What? Cupcakes! Oh. Bartleby, it's raining cupcakes! I don't think anyone's had a birthday party like this before! Kakaraka! Way to go, Kakaraka! Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, True! true. Best, Best party, party ever! party is amazing! Thanks, everyone! This is even better than the best birthday party ever, and it's all thanks to Bartleby. Great, Great job, Bartleby! Bartleby. Ah, oh, shucks. Thanks, True. You deserve it. True? Hey, where'd you go? And now, for your birthday entertainment... Wow. May I please present to you our great guest of honor! Yeah. Sorry, True. <laughs> it's okay, Bartleby. We have lots of other decorations to put up that won't pop. Phew! Thanks, True. And when we're done, the color Sam is gonna look super. Super duper for the Rainbow Kings. Super, super duper, duper dance, dance party! party. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Thanks for starting the decorating, but it's time to let a professional party planner take it from here. That's me! <laughs> And my decorating won't be the only thing worth seeing at this party. You are a really good dancer, Griselda. I know. And when we're dance setting up and the party's in full swing, every creature everywhere will know it too. Yay, playtime! <laughs> Uh-oh. Well, I'm glad you're having fun. Now stop drooling on me. Here, let me help. <laughs> Thanks for the dance, True. <laughs> My pleasure, B. True, hello! How's the setup coming for my super duper dance party? Great, Your Majesty. We're almost done decorating. And best of all, DJ Bingo Bango will be coming soon to spin some tunes! Tickle me pink! All eyes in the kingdom will be on him. All eyes? Here's my chance. True. W would you mind running down to the transit station and bringing him back here? Of course, Your Majesty. I'd be happy to go. If she wasn't so busy with all these decorations. But don't worry, Rainbow King. I'll go get Wingo Clango. Bingo Bango. That's what I said. Ta-ta! This is my chance to hear Bingo Dingo's music before the party. <laughs> It was nice of Griselda to go get Bingo Bango for us. It was, wasn't it? Maybe a bit too nice. <laughs> On behalf of the Rainbow King, I bid you welcome Blingo Bongo. Well, thank you. Huh? What? No, no, not you. Uh, uh. Oh, how nice. Fergie, stop! Uh. <laughs> Thanks, little doggy. Oh, it's you! Finally! Yep, the name is Bingo B -b -b Bango. <laughs> Hello, Blingo Blongo. Oh, it's Bingo Bango. That's what I said. And I'm Griselda. We're all excited to have you play your music at the Super Duper Dance Party. Sweet. I'm a little nervous, but I'm ready for it. Don't worry, when I'm dancing to your music, all eyes will be on me. Oh, cool. I guess. 
Now, let's go to my grand hall where I, I, I mean we, can practice. You want it? I want to hear what you've got. <laughs> wow, the Coliseum looks so great now. Yep, we decorated our hearts out. The balloons are up, the streamers are ready, the scratching post is out. You know, for whoever feels like scratching. Okay, that last one's just for me. Oh, wait, I know what we forgot. What? Nap time. <laughs> Fishy poof crackers. <laughs> Griselda should be back with Bingo Bango soon. I'll wake you then. Now, Grismos, pretend you're the crowd just watching, and I walk out into the stage. Got it? Yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Music! <laughs> Play something that I can dance to, but won't make everyone else want to dance? <sighs> From the top. <laughs> Ugh. Nobody can dance to that. Not even a great dancer like me. I am supremely annoyed. I'm sorry. If I can't play for a great dancer like you, well, then maybe I'm... <laughs> A terrible DJ. I'm sure you can do better. You certainly don't want to disappoint the Rainbow King and all those people at the party. Okay, you can start the music again. Hit it! Wingo Klingo? Rude. I was having the sweetest dream about my fishy poof crackers when you woke me. Yeah, they were dancing right on the tip of my tongue. Oh, fishy poof crackers. So fishy, so poofy, so crackery. Your dream sounds tasty. But we have a problem. Griselda and Bingo Bango didn't show up at the Coliseum, and I don't see them here. I spy with my kitten eye something that is... <gasps> Bingo Bango shaped! He's leaving! Stop! Wait, Bingo Bango! Bingo Bango! Bingo Bango! Wait! Come back! True, stop that bus! Well, that's just great. Now we don't have any DJ for the super duper dance party. Mm, what happened? Why didn't you meet Bingo Bango? I did meet him. He came to my castle to practice, but he didn't play very well at all. Really? That doesn't sound like him. Then he said he was a terrible DJ and ran off. Just like that. Where are we going to find another DJ? I don't think we need another DJ. We just need to help Bingo Bango feel better. We need some wish help. Cumulo! <laughs> Hi, Cumulo. Are you ready to take us to the wishing tree? <laughs> Then let's go! Greetings, True and Bartleby. What's that you're using? This is my wishoscope. It lets me see inside a wish to learn more about its temperament. Temper, huh? The type of personality it has. See? This wish has a bubbly center. That means it loves to laugh. Observe. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Wish. So are you both ready for the super duper dance party? Not really. Our DJ Bingo Bango left. Oh no. You can't have music without a DJ. Let's take a moment. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> <sighs> so why did Bingo Bango leave? Griselda said he wasn't playing very well. And when we saw him, he looked really upset. Yeah, he even told Griselda he was a terrible DJ. Hmm. It sounds like Bingo Bango has lost his confidence. Confidence, of course. Confidence. Yeah. Yeah, what's confidence? <laughs> it's when you know you can do something well. 
So if I feel like I'm really good at doing kitty natty jump spin kicks... Then you have confidence. Yes, I do! Jump and spin and kick! <laughs> <laughs> but if Bingo Bango feels like he can't play music anymore... Then he's lost his confidence. We have to help him get it back. I'm also great at doing jump and spin and quick <laughs> falls. <laughs> <laughs> nice moves, Bartleby. Confidence. I think putting Bingo Bango in a good mood would be a great first step. And he was so quiet when we saw him, he might need something to help him be louder. And remember, he needs to get his beat back. Those are all important for a DJ. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes. more about them. Let's check the Wishopedia. Hmm. Ah, yes. Here it is. Shim Shim is exceptional at oscillating. Oscillating? That means its long, wiggly arms can shimmy all over the place. That's great. We want to cheer Bingo Bango up. So I'll get Shim Shim to wiggle until Bingo Bango giggles. <laughs> I'm sure it won't take long. Now your second wish. Ah, here. Pom Pom. It can make the quietest whispers very loud. <laughs> <laughs> the perfect wish for a quiet DJ. What? Buffet? Is it all you can eat? <laughs> <laughs> Where is your third wish? Ah, here it is. Beepaw. It's all about bouncing at different speeds and different patterns. Hmm. I don't know how bouncing will help Bingo Bango feel better, but I'm happy to give it a try. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. <laughs> Come on, Bartleby. Let's find Bingo Bango and help get his confidence back. Yay! You're the best, Z. Good luck. There's Bingo Bango. Uh-oh. It looks like he's heading into the never-ending forest. We have to stop him. Oops. I know just what to say to cheer him up. Bingo Bango? The Bingo Bango? It's you! We really love your music. Why? Well, I'm a terrible DJ. Okay, that did not cheer him up. My name is True, and this is Bartleby. We came to bring you to the Super Duper Dance Party. Oh, I can't play there. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yikes. We really need to do something. Time to use my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Shim Shim! Wish come true! <laughs> okay, Shim Shim, can you do a little jiggle wiggle to make Bingo Bango giggle? <laughs> <laughs> it's not working. Let's try again. Wiggle bigger, Shim Shim. <laughs> I'm wiggling like jelly. It's shaking my belly. <laughs> it's a wiggle off. Wiggle, 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 Whoa! That bump made a really fun sound. Well, let me try. Yeah, great sound. Boom, boom, boom. That gives 
gives me an idea. Bingo Bango loves musical sounds. If we make more, maybe that will cheer him up. Cool. <laughs> I know you're trying not to laugh. Come on, I see a little smile. Let's make it bigger. <laughs> okay, okay, <laughs> you got me. Woo! You made me laugh even though I didn't want to. <laughs> You're good. Thanks. You too, Shim Shim. Way to wiggle. Time to go back in the pack. Are you feeling better now? <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Enough to start playing music at the Super Duper Dance Party? Uh, I don't know oh, I want to, but what if I... Well, I'm really terrible. Why don't you try making music right here? No crowds, just us. Okay, uh, here goes. That's it? You can do it? I can't. I'm terrible. I can't do it. Oh, no. Bingo Bango, wait. No, stop following me. I see him. He's hiding behind a tree. I've been a tree hider many, many times. It's not a good sign. Bingo Bango, that was a good start. You just have to warm up a little. Playing music is what you do best. What I used to do best. Now I'll just disappoint everyone. His confidence is still really low. Is it ever? How can we get him to play at the dance party if we can't even get him to play for us? <gasps> Not for us, with us! Come on! Ooh, great sound! When I strummed Shim Shim, Bingo Bango joined in and made his own sounds. If we play a whole song, maybe he'll join in again. Great idea, True. Let's make some music. I said, whoa. <laughs> Sounds like we need more practice. Mm-hmm. We need someone. Someone to give us a beat to play to. <gasps> Wait, I have an idea. My bee polish can help us keep a beat by jumping up and down. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, people. Wish come true! <laughs> Beepa, are you ready to make a beat that helps us move our feet? Uh-huh. All right, Beepa, let's see you jump. <laughs> whoa, whoa, maybe not so fast. Can you jump to a regular beat? Boom, 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 boom. Oh, yeah! Look at you go! First, well, I don't know how to get there. <laughs> wow, listen to that crowd. Sounds like they're ready to dance. Are you ready to make them dance, Bingo Bango? Well, I think so. Um, maybe I... Yes! Yes! Well, I'm ready! Yes! Wait! No! On second thought! 
No! You're still not ready to play at the party? I was ready for that, but now I'm not so sure. Oh, hello, Jingo Clango. It's Bingo Bango. That's what I said? You came back. <laughs> I guess the Super Duper Dance Party has a DJ after all. I don't know. Some people think I'm not good enough. Griselda, when you told Bingo Bango he couldn't play well, he believed you and felt <laughs> really bad about it. He did? I didn't mean to make him feel bad. But if he doesn't want to play, no biggie. I brought my own DJ to the dance party. Okay, Forky, drop the beat. <laughs> Anytime now. Forky Wookiekins, I know you can do this. Please. He should stick to drooling. He's good at that. Ugh. Okay, fine. Have What's-His-Name play and let everybody dance. Yay! I just wanted all eyes to be on me. Aww. Aww. Griselda! Everyone likes to dance, but when we all dance together, that's when we have the most fun. I'm sorry to tell everyone. There isn't going to be a dance party. Huh? What? Rainbow King, what's wrong? Look! We don't have a crowd! Oh, no! So that noise we heard before, it wasn't people coming into the Coliseum. It was people leaving. When Bingo Bango didn't show up, they decided to go home. Great clouds. There's nothing super-duper about this. Bingo Bango's here, Your Majesty. We can save this party. But how true? There's nobody left. You're the only one who can save the Super Duper Dance Party, Bingo Bango. Can you do it? Save the party. Yes, I can! Dance, 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 I don't get it. I'm playing great now. But nobody's coming back. Hmm. Maybe they can't hear you. Don't worry, I've got this. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Pom Pom! Pom Pom! Wish come true! <laughs> okay, Pom Pom, are you ready to pump up the volume? Mm-hmm. Let's send this music all across the kingdom! Super Duper Dance Party! Thanks, True! I couldn't have gotten back on stage without your help. Yep. Any minute now, everybody will be dancing. It would help if someone got them started. <laughs> Look, you've got fans! <laughs> you were right, True. Dancing with others is fun! Great dancing, Griselda! <laughs> now this is what I call a super-duper dance party! Thank you, True! Happy to help, Your Majesty. Yeti sitting. Next stop, Yeti Village. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? <laughs> Pardon me, we just left. But I can't blame you for being excited. I can't wait to babysit the Yeti triplets. Me too! Eee! Yeah, three Yeti babies equals three times the fun! Which is why... I packed all my toys. I just didn't know if they'd be into squeaky toys. <laughs> or tin foil balls, or silly faces. <laughs> I'm sure the Yeti babies will love your toys. Thanks for bringing them, Bartleby. And thank you, Griselda, for coming along to help. Oh, it's no problem. After all, I am a pro when it comes to babies. Look, I brought my How to Raise a Fruki book. Written by the most fabulous writer I know, me. <sighs> a whole 
whole chapter on baby talk? I'm fluent. Listen. Is little baby Bartleby excited to see the Yeti Weddies? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's good. Yeah. <laughs> you are a baby expert. Mm hmm. I raised Brookie all by myself, and he turned out perfectly. Mm. Babysitting is going to be easy. Right. Well, we just have to remember, though, not to actually sit on the babies, okay, Grizz? No baby sitting. Look, I have a whole chapter on how not to sit on the babies. Last stop, Yeti Village. We're here! This is going to be so great! We are so ready to babysit your fuzzy little triplets. I've got my Fruki training book. And I brought all my toys. Hi, Hi Snick. Hi. Babies. Yuck. <laughs> Yuck. Fluff. Aw, they're almost cute enough to be princesses. <laughs> Okay, the babies just had their nap. I love marble berry. And they had some normal berries. And now it's ready! Ah. And now they're ready for playtime! Did someone say playtime? No, not that, not that. No, no, yes, yes! Hmm, what should we play? Fetch? Chase your tail round and round? Smother Bartleby with kisses? Brookie can play that for hours. Whoa, 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 whoa! Don't you don't! Aww. No! Bye! See you at sunset! We'll make sure they're in bed by then. All right, cuties. Who's ready for some true tickles? Hey, where'd they go? <laughs> I have Grok! Correction, I had Grok. Bloof, <laughs> nobody touches the crown. <laughs> Okay, Grok, that's a good girl. Uncle Barnaby's arms are getting a little tired. I'm just gonna put you down for a second. Okay, who wants to go for a kitty back ride? Huh? What? <laughs> there you are, you silly girl. <sighs> Whoa! Phew. Wait a ninja catch, B. Bundles of fun outside. Where things are less breaky. <laughs> Who wants to go for a little carriage ride? <laughs> Wait, we need toys. My Fruki Schmookums never leaves home without his favorite chew toy. <laughs> B, what do you have? Well, let's see. I got the uh, squeaky mousey. No. Uh, yarn ball. Uh, any takers? Hmm. Tough crowd. Let's see. <laughs> I know, you can't go wrong with a tinfoil ball! <gasps> the babies! They left without us! Playground. Okay, who wants a push from Uncle Bartleby? <laughs> After he has a rest. Bloof, that is such a cute pose. Okay, now stay. I've got to face bubble this. Ready? Say I'm a cutie. Uh, uh, huh? Uh, 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 uh. Silly Floof, come down here. The only thing cuter than a princess is a princess with a Yeti baby. <laughs> <laughs>
by the river. <laughs> You're right, Drew. That sounds way less jumpy and crashy. See? Isn't this fun? <laughs> She wants to sniff around the tree. Fruki loves sniffing trees. And then he... <gasps> ah! Fruki does not do that! Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, thank you, Grok. But we should put that down now, okay? Uh, ah! Wait! I meant put it back where it was! <laughs> Good boy, Floof. Now show Grok how to play nice with trees. Uh-oh. That tree is heading for the bridge. Uh, true. That's a lot of water. We'd better go find those triplets and see what they're up to. I'm sure there's something about all of this in my How to Train Your Fruity book. on logs is way harder than it looks. It is. The triplets make it look so easy. They're impossible to catch, so we need a way to round them up. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree. Wishing Tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing <laughs> Tree. about these wishes. Now let's see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Grok 
Grapplo. Hey, ho, Grapplo. Ah. Grapplo has mighty grabbing power. He can grab onto anything and lift even the heaviest objects. Oh, oh hey, ha, ha. Perfect. Grapplo, you can help us unblock the river. Oh. Uh -huh. Your next wish is Hugsy. Oh, yeah. This is a fun one. Hugsy. Hugsy loves wrapping anyone in super tight hugs. Who doesn't love hugs? Hugs! Hugs! <laughs> Hugsy, you can help us round up the triplets. <laughs> and last, but definitely not least, we have Twisty. A super strong wish. Twisty, great to see you again. <laughs> this one is a force of nature. Twisty can twist up anything, even a strong tornado. That's incredible! I'm just not sure how twisting could help with a flood or baby eddies, but I can't wait to figure it out. Oh. <laughs> Zoo zip zap, wishes in my pack. <laughs> Whoa, let's go fix Yeti Village. Thanks, Z. Bye, Z. You're welcome. Good luck. Good job watching the babies, Griselda. Oh, no problem. You know, I always knew I was a great babysitter. But now I know I'm a fantastic carriage sitter, too. <laughs> Time for some wish power, True. You got it. Cunio, take us to the bridge, please. Time for my first wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Grapplo! Wish come true! Hi, Grapplo! See that bridge over there? Oh uh ho! -huh. There's a big tree that's stuck underneath. Can you grab onto it and pull it out? Oh uh ho! -huh. Great! Okay, Grapplo, get into position. Hey ho! -huh. Now! Oh, yeah. Keep trying, Grapplo! Yeah. Yay! Hey, look! The water's going down! Just kiss the ground. Bye, Cubilo. See you, buddy. Grapplo, that was really impressive. Up top, Grapplo. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. Cutest plumber ever. Now tuck yourself in. Okay, now to round up those babies and get them home before sunset. Where are those cute Yeti babies anyway? Huh? <laughs> that didn't really answer my question. Which way did they go? Your can flew for swinging over there, and there, and over there. <laughs> okay, but where's Grok? That came from over there. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. Don't worry, babies! Uncle Bartleby will get you down! Um, true. How is Uncle Bartleby gonna get them down? Hmm. <laughs> we'll give them something that babies love. Hugs! Time for my second wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Hugsy! Yeah! Wish come true! Okay, Hugsy. These little yetis need your super huggy power. Oh, yeah! I love that! Now's your chance, Hugsy. It's Cuddle O'Clock! <laughs> nice squeezing, Hugsy. You can let go now. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Grok. And now to buckle you in, to make sure you stay put. Cut that away. 
Yeah, then we're back. <laughs> Here comes your. Okay, Hugsy. Time for round two. was fun, wasn't it? That's two babies down and one to go. <laughs> Hope your snuggle supply is high, Hugsy. <laughs> no need, True. Hugsy can sit this one out. My book has a whole chapter on what to do when your Fruki's off his leash. Come here, Floof. You be a good baby, Yeti. <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> When training your Fruki, offer treats as a reward. <laughs> I've got some yummy snacky wackies. <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> Such good yetis. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Thanks for everything, Hugsy. <laughs> now tuck yourself in. <laughs> well, that's that. Now let's get these yeti babies home in bed. <laughs> You're getting sleepy already. See, I knew babysitting was going to be easy. Yeah, it's a good thing you brought your book, Griselda. And bringing your toys was a great idea, too, Bartleby. We're a pretty good babysitting team. Oh, what a wonderful sunset. I love the way it feels on my face. Huh? Sunset? And oh, look, there's Erg and Snick returning from their big day out. <gasps> Erg and Snick? I really hope they don't see that big pile of trees over there. It's messy. Pile of trees? Oh, no, we can't leave the Yeti village like this. Cleaning up trees is not in my babysitting book. Griselda Bartleby, you need to get those Yeti babies back in bed before Erg and Snick get home. But True, who's going to clean up that mess? I'll take care of those trees. Okay, okay True, True, we're, we're on, on it. it. It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Twisty. Wish come true! <laughs> Hi, Twisty. We need your help and fast. You see all those trees over there? We need to clean them up before Mom and Papa Yeti get home. I know you can twist up a tidy tornado to lift them. <laughs> <laughs> Better hurry up. Twist, Twisty! I'm sure they have the triplets snug in their beds by now. <laughs> okay, Twisty, now's our chance. <laughs> Whoa, oh, oh. Great job, Twisty. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> Zoo Zip Zap wishes in my Yeah! <gasps> oh, ah. Ah. Shh. Hi. Oh. Thanks for the fun day. You sure kept us on our toes. I hope you two had a lovely time. We had such a fun day with your little triplets. Whoa, oh boy, they sure do know how to play. <laughs> and good thing I was here because absolutely nothing went wrong. Here's my card. 
You got something for us? Oh, you shouldn't have. It was our pleasure. Love is silly. <gasps> Frozen Sasuni juice balls. Woo! Thank, thank you so much. much. To the best babysitting team ever. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Zip zap zoom. I got this. Back at ya. Yep. Bed. Got it. Oops. <laughs> Sorry, really? Bartleby. Oh. Thanks, little helper. I got it. Oh, oh. oops. Oh. And uh, that's a ball off my head. You have a race car! No way! Say hello to my rainbow racer! Hi, rainbow, rainbow racer. racer! Why do you have a pumpkin racer? Once upon a moonbeam, my rainbow guard and I were a racing team. I still like to take it out for a spin to feel the wind in my cape. Uh, isn't that right, rainbow guard? Mm-hmm. And what fun it was doing a few laps around the kingdom. Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B? That it's time for fishy poof crackers and a cuddly lap nap? You can nap later. First, let's build our own racer. Oh, I like that idea even better. Let's go. Bye-bye. I can't wait to see what they build. We're gonna build, build, build our own speedy machine. It'll be cool, 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 watching glimmer and glee. We'll feel the breeze, breeze, breeze blowing through our hair. Having fun, fun, fun without a single care. Driving, driving, we're all high-fiving, loud as thunder. It's no wonder it's full speed fun when we're with each other. Silver sparks. It's beautiful. You really like it? Oh, yes. Your car is so amazing. I'm announcing the Rainbow Kingdom's first Great Rainbow Rally. Yay! Oh, right. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Welcome to the Great Rainbow Rally. <gasps> this is going to be so great. I'm gonna toss my crackers! <laughs> Let's raise a rainbow cheer for today's racers. Racer number four, the Yetis. Hi. Racer number two, a Rainbow City bus. I'm a bus. Racer number five, mm -hmm. my rainbow mm -hmm. guard. Racer number three, the Forest Flower Kids. Racer number one, True and Bartleby. Racer number six, Princess Griselda! Yeah. Oh, hi, Griselda. Your car is so, well, Griselda-like. Thanks, True. My Grismobile is the finest luxury automobile around. It's built to be first, because there's no race without a winner. Well, I think the real winner is the one who has the most fun. It sure is, huh, Fuzzy Mice? Ooh, Fuzzy Mice, so fuzzy and fuzzy. Good luck, everybody! Mm -hmm. Happy mm -hmm. racing! Ah, thanks, True. Racers, starting here, you will zip, zap, zoom all across the kingdom, following these special green arrow signs. First car to zip, zap, zoom back here wins! <laughs> so buckle up, Rainbow Racers! Get ready to roll! It's Great Rainbow! Not as fast as 
is me, though. See you at the finish line. if I want to stay in the lead. Ta-ta, Arrow! All aboard! Uh-oh. I'm supposed to be racing. Well, welcome to the race. Been there. Done that. Been there. Done that. Hey, that's new. No, no, that's not new. Hold on a second, Bartleby. Rainbow King said we're supposed to follow the green arrow signs. These ones are red. <laughs> Where did we last see a green arrow? That away. More of the green arrow signs point that way. So that way must be the right way. Hi, little helper. Could you spin that green arrow to point the right way for us? Thanks. Great rainbow racers. Follow us back. To the race course. Uh -huh. <laughs> Interesting. A few crystals broke off. If someone dries over them, they could pop a tire or wipe out. Well, there's always something in the road to look out for. Let's go, Fruki. Oh, watch it! Racing, racing, everybody chasing! Okay, let's never do that again. Is everyone all right? Hi! You betcha! Hey, this is a bus stop. Well, it isn't mine either. No complaining on the bus. <gasps> and I've got a flat tire! True! What do we do? What do we do? Don't worry, everyone. True knows! You do, right? Because I don't. I really, really do. I really, really do. We're gonna fix it. those jumps, please. Hey, can we get back in this race, please? There. Good as new. Thanks, Drew. Happy to help. Now let's get back to the race. Was, um, that the only road out? Mm -hmm. Then we're trapped! Trapped! I've seen how this movie ends. Huh, I was gonna be the one who panics there, but she is nailing it. 
do we need a wish now? Well, fixing a tire is one thing, but moving a giant heavy boulder? <laughs> yeah, we definitely need some wish help. Cue the Milo! We'll be right back! To the wishing tree, please! Faster, Cue Milo! Faster! You're just in time for the race. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> so, how goes your race? Wait, if you're here and you're not racing, that means... We have a big problem, Z. A bunch of racers are stuck at the bottom of a canyon, and the only path leading out is blocked. By a boulder that went... Whop! Thunderbolts and lightning. Let's have a think about this. Oh, hold on. <laughs> we have a winner! Woo! Come, let's sit and have a think about this. How do you think you can fix this problem? I need a wish that can help us get past the boulder so we can drive back up to the race course. <laughs> yeah, my fuzzy mice get antsy when we're not racing. <laughs> How big is this boulder? It's huge! So we're gonna need a wish to help us get it out of the way. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. What interesting wishes these are. <laughs> Let's see what the Wishopedia tells us about their powers. Wish number one is Sizer. Uh -huh. It's a wish that can make anything bigger or smaller. <laughs> you could help us get around the boulder by shrinking it down for us. What a good second wish. Roper Roo. You can use this wish to lasso things and move them. That's great. If one of the cars goes in a ditch, we can pull it out with Rope Roo. And your last wish is Cube Bigly. <laughs> it wiggles, it wobbles, and it's very springy. I'm not sure how this wish will help me get the racers going again. But I'll think of some way to use it. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Ready to go, Bartleby? Almost. What? I really like fuzzy mice. <laughs> Thanks, Z. Good luck. Happy racing. True. Did you think of a way to get us out of here? Did you? Did you? Don't worry. I did. Zip, zap, zip, I choose you! Wake up, Sizer! Wish come true! See that giant boulder blocking the way? We have to make it smaller. Great job, Sizer! The pathway's clear! Let's drive! Everyone stop! The pathway's not clear! The 
those crystals popped my tire. If we drive over them, our tires will pop too. There's way too many to shrink down. I know. Sizer, shrink us down, please. Uh -huh. Can't say I was expecting that. Come on, everybody, let's drive! <laughs> Hang on, this is the good part! Oh my! Yeah! <laughs> Enjoy the ride! My soda! I'm a racing cat driver! I stop. No eating or drinking on the bus. Thanks, Sizer. I don't think this race can get any more fun. Are you sure? I was thinking you might want to turn driving. <gasps> You're the best, Drew! <laughs> I am. I really am. Now buckle up. So the pedal on the left is the gas, and the handle but one. <laughs> yeah! It's the Forest Flower Kids. Hello. Bye-bye. I'm way ahead of the other racers, and that's good. But they're getting closer, and that is bad. I need more speed to stay in the lead. Activate the Grismo Turbo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Looks like we're all here. Hmm? <gasps> Except for the bus. Oh? oh, don't worry about me, True. Just stuck in a cactus. Ah, I'm stuck in a cactus. Get me down. Get me down. Yetis, you're big and strong. Can you get the bus down? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I'm gonna whoopsie. If Yetis can't get her down, what can? A super strong rope wish. rope let's get pulling. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, rope Wish come true! We need to make a lasso so you can help get the bus down. Can you do it? Yahoo! Rope, 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 oh. 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 Is this gonna take all day? Uh. You can do it, rope, rope. I know you can. No! Oh. I'm feeling that squeeze. Careful. <laughs> Yay! Yeah. Great job, Roperoo! Yes! A big thank you from me. And me! Hands on the bus! whoop doo Time to go back in the pack. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. We have a race to finish! <laughs> faster, Grismos! Fast, fast, faster! <laughs> Hold on, Fruity! <laughs> oh, Phew. Phew. <gasps> oh, no. Help! Help! True! Stop! Griselda's in trouble! to be a crystal pancake. Don't worry, we'll save you. I have 
one wish left, be Cubigly, the jelly wish. How can a big jelly cube help us? I can have Cubigly cover Griselda's car and roll it away from the cliff. What if it falls? Well, it'll be surrounded by jelly and have a nice cushy landing. <laughs> Are you sure this will work, True? Because I'm very delicate. Yeah, delicate. Like a Yeti's toenail delicate. Cute Bigly, we need a lot of jiggle. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Ooh. Wake up, Cute Bigly. <laughs> Wish come true. <laughs> okay, Cute Bigly, I need you to jiggle Griselda to safety. <laughs> Ready? to win. See you at the finish line. Come on, everyone. Back in the race. There's a car ahead of us. And the first racer across the finish line is the Forest Flower Kids. <laughs> This is still not my star. Just get out. Can you believe I didn't win? Did you at least have fun? Yes, I guess I did. So winning isn't everything. Huh, who knew? Congratulations to all our racers. We had a blast, Rainbow King. Splendid. Now to celebrate with some royal nibbles and sips. Nibbles and sips? Mm -hmm. Everybody wins with those. <laughs> 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 Friendship Day. Okay, here we go. With Marley's skillful serve, the Friendship Day slow mall showdown has begun. <laughs> oh, and True returns it with a stunning spiral swoop. Excellent elevation. I got it. Wait for it. Keep waiting. I call this the slow mo slow ball flip flop tail chop. Hi! Ah! <laughs> Great moves, Bartleby. Oh, where'd it go? <gasps> okay, not a problem. I'll get the ball and stay completely dry while doing it. I, just, I... <sighs> Come on, ball! Come to Bartleby. Ah! Sorry I grabbed your tail, B, but I thought it was an emergency. It was. I almost got wet. But you would never let that happen, would you, True? Well, not on Friendship Day. Griselda? Ta-da! We're here to brighten your Friendship Day. You brightened it all right. You got a dimmer switch on that thing? Now that everyone's here, I have something to show you. Come on! So, for Friendship Day, I made you all friendship bracelets. Presents? Thanks, Drew. That's so thoughtful of you. Cool! We're all matchy-matchy. No one told me we give presents on Friendship Day. I would have got you all really good presents. You don't have to. I just felt like making friendship bracelets for my friends. And there are lots of different ways you can show you care on Friendship Day. Like baking Nummelberry cookies to share. Want one? Oh, great. Now we're sharing, too. And friends look after each other, like, um, um, uh, when, when, when True saved me from getting wet. Here you go, Fruki. But I didn't make gifts or bake cookies or save anyone. I didn't do anything nice. When do I get to be nice? Well, we couldn't have Friendship Day without you. You were there for us when we needed you. Well, I am really good at showing up. Ow! Eee! A gravity grab! Get it off! Ah! True, get it off me! Okay, hold still and I'll grab it. Yikes! 
Okay, give me a sec. There's gotta be a right way to remove a grippity grab. Uh, hurry! Yikes! It's a grippity grab snack attack! But save the snacks! Shoo, shoo, get off! <gasps> Fergie, look out! A grippity is after your pretty neckerchief! Huh? Oh, uh, uh. Hey! The grippities are taking all our fashion accessories! Since when do grippity grabs care about style? They don't, but they do like shiny things. In fact, legend has it, there's a giant grippity grab in the sea with a whole cave full of shiny treasure. So, if the grippity grabs like shiny things, here, little grippity, want this? Problem solved. Oh, you saved me, True. <gasps> you saved me, and you gave up your bracelet to do it. You're such a great friend! It's no big deal. I'm just glad you're okay. I'm a great friend, too. Just you wait and see. I'm going to get your bracelet back. Stop! Come back with Tris bracelet! Yeah, in my glasses! Yeah, Nummelberry cookies don't work so well as sunglasses. Mm, but they taste great. You come back here, you little grippities. You are ruining friendship day. Being a good friend is harder than I thought. Oh. I'll just make True a new, even better friendship bracelet. Out of extra special, super sparkly seashells. Handpicked by me. <coughs> Patience, Frookykins. We'll play as soon as I'm done being thoughtful. Ta-da! All done. Isn't it irresistible? Of course it is. <coughs> <gasps> you must be that giant grippity grab who collects shiny things. <laughs> Look, I totally get liking pretty things, but I'd like my bracelet back now, please. <laughs> hey, give it back! <laughs> That's not a toy, you know. I made that for a friend. <gasps> what? No, not you. A princess can't be friends with someone so shellfish. La, 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 la. No fair! I can't swim that far. I'm not some fish, you know. <laughs> what did you just do? And why do my feet feel all floppy? <gasps> my perfect princess toes! How am I supposed to try on new shoes? I thought Griselda would be back by now. Let's go find her. No, that shouldn't be too hard. Just follow that bright light. Um, that's the sun, Bartleby. Oops. Um, hi, Mr. Sun. Happy Friendship Day. We should be able to follow Griselda's footprints in the sand. Good idea, Z. Let's go. Give it back. <laughs> this day is not going like I planned. Oops. Sorry, Fruki. I'm not used to having a floppy fish tail. Ha ha! La la Wait here, Fruki Kins. I won't be long. I just have to catch Grippity, get my friendship bracelet, and make him turn me back into a whole princess so I don't have to spend the rest of my life in the sea. Bing, bing, boom. I'll be back soon. Toodles! <gasps> Look at that shine! It's Griselda! With the giant Grippity Grab! The legend is true! <laughs> Griselda has, has a fish tail! <laughs> what happened, Fruki? Isn't it obvious what happened? Griselda would rather spend Friendship Day with a giant grippity than with us. Don't worry, Fruki. We'll take care of you. <sighs> well, the things we do for our friends. Ugh. Griselda would never leave Fruki behind. Especially on Friendship Day. I think Griselda needs our help. We have to go and save her. Wait, what? Like, go in the water? Yes, but since we haven't been turned into fish, we'll need wish help. Cue me, low. Come on, Fruki. You too. To the wishing tree, please. Happy Friendship Day to you, too, Wishes! 
But there's no time to chat. Our friend needs our help. Right. Let's sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, we think a giant grippity grab turned Griselda into a... An extra shiny fish girl. So I need a wish to undo the spell and turn Griselda back into herself. And since Griselda is under the sea, I need a wish that will allow me to travel underwater. It's friendship day. We should all go and help. <laughs> as long as I can stay completely dry. All right. I need a wish that will take us all underwater. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> wishing tree. What an inspiring combination of wishes! I can't wait to see what the Wishipedia says about their powers! So this is Subba. Hi, Subba. Subba is an underwater wish. Subba gets big enough to fit all your friends inside and keep them dry. Oh, I like him. Best wish yet. That's perfect. Subba will help us all travel underwater to find Griselda. Boop, boop, boop. Your next wish is undo. Well, hello, undo. Undo! <laughs> this is a reversing wish. When it spins backwards over something, it undoes it. But undo can only be used once. If this wish can turn Griselda back into a two-legged princess, then undo only has to work once. And your last wish is shim shim. Shim Shim has helped us once before. It's a wish that's really good at wiggling. Hello again, Shim Shim. That <laughs> tickles. <laughs> I'm not sure how wiggling can help save Griselda, but I'll think of something. Zoo Zip Zap wishes in my pack. Now let's go get our friend Griselda. How? How do fish swim with these floppy tails anyway? <clears throat> Excuse me, coming through. You can't get me. You can't get away from me that easy, Grippity. Uh, this fish tail is supremely annoying. Yeah. Uh, uh, thanks? So you're giving me the bracelet back? <sighs> I guess not. <laughs> Poor little Fruki. You miss Griselda, don't you? But don't worry. We'll find her under all that water, won't we, True? You bet. Time for my first wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Subba! Wish come true! Hi, Subba! We need to go under the sea to find Griselda. Can you help us out? <laughs> Subba! All aboard! Okay, Subba, into the sea! Everybody keep an eye out for Griselda. She should be pretty easy to spot with that shiny tail. Oh, oh, I see it. Are you behind that rock? Uh, that way, Subba. Boom, boom. Hmm. 
That's not her. It's a school of fish. All those fish are wearing the same tail as Griselda. She is not going to be happy with that. Hey, how are we going to spot Griselda if everything has a shiny tail? <laughs> Don't worry, Fruki. Griselda is down here somewhere. We'll find her. But how? It's not as easy as following her tracks in the sand. Right. She can't leave footprints. If she doesn't have feet... Griselda may not be leaving tracks, but Giant Grippity is. Good thinking, True. Told you, Fruki. True will find Griselda in no time. Okay, Subba. Follow those tracks. La -la 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 -la. No fair. Mm. You know I can't walk out of the water into... <gasps> this amazing cave. Your home is almost as nice as my palace. So many pretty, shiny things. <gasps> Including me. I'm not a half fish. I'm an adorable, glamorous, unbelievably cute mermaid. If only my friends could see me now. <sighs> I miss them, you know. Especially my best friend, Fruki, and Z, and Bartleby, and True. She's the one I made the beautiful bracelet for. You know how it is with friends. Uh-huh. Ah. Oh, maybe not. Huh? <gasps> Thank you! I have to give this to True for Friendship Day to show what an amazing friend I am. Shiny things. Wait a sec. Is this for me? <laughs> so you want to be friends? Yeah, 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 yeah. All that chasing and hiding was just playing? Uh huh. Yeah. Well, of course a princess and a grippity can be friends. We have so much in common. Uh. We both love shiny things. Uh -huh. We both have beautifully decorated homes. <gasps> Next time, you can come to my house. I'll have my Grismos build us a water park, and we can decorate it together. Won't that be fun? Uh, 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 uh. After you turn me back into a princess, of course. Uh, uh. Uh, uh. Oh, no! Where's your magic thingy? <gasps> the clam has it! Grippity, you have to get it out and change me back. Oh no! Can you use your pincers to cut yourself free? If only my friend True were here, she'd know what to do. Hmm, maybe. And she really is a half fish. I'm not a half fish. I'm a whole mermaid. Thank you very much. Did the giant Grippity do this to you? Yes, but he can't turn me back. No problem. We'll undo his spell with my second witch. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, undo. wish can reverse what Grippity did to you. Really? So you can use your wish to undo what he did to himself? He was trying to help me and he got all tangled up. He was trying to help you? Like a friend? Well, yes. He really is my friend. A princess and a Grippity can be friends, you know. Griselda, I can only use undo once. If undo frees Grippity, I don't have a wish to turn you back. Then, use the 
wish to free Grippity. What? what? We're friends now, and friends are always there for you when you need them, right? But what about you? Grippity is the one who really needs help. I'm fine. Um, Griselda, you may not have noticed, but you have a fish tail. It's a mermaid tail. And being a mermaid isn't so bad. But you have to live in water. Not a problem. I already have plans for a water park. And I could give Fruki swimming lessons. <laughs> she did not mean that. Griselda, are you sure? I'm sure. Let's do this. Okay, Undo. Do your thing. Whoa! Undo! Now back in the pack. I knew you could do it, True. Thanks, B. Griselda, that was very generous of you. Are you sure you'll be okay being a half-ish? Uh, I mean, mermaid? Well, it was nice having a super sparkly tail, and I was starting to get the hang of swimming. <laughs> but I do love my fancy shoes and running around with my little fruky kins. <laughs> Sorry, Griselda. I don't think my last wish can turn you back into a princess. Oh! <laughs> What's Grippity doing now? What's going on there? Oh, Grippity's magic thingy is inside that clam. His trident? The same one he used to turn you into a mermaid? Of course. But that clam clammed up and won't give it back. I think we can fix that. Time for my third wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Shim Shim! Wish come true! Shim Shim the Wiggle Wish? How will that help? Remember how Shim Shim tickled my arm in the wishing tree? I bet a little tickle can get that grumpy glam to loosen up. Um, I still don't get it. <laughs> See, you can't laugh with your mouth closed. Yeah. Oh my! So if the clam laughs, it'll open. Okay, Shim Shim, go away. Shim Shim makes the first move. The classic fast, slow, fast tickle. Oh, clam blocks that move. There'll be no laughing today. Shim Shim is really upping her game. Clam is having a hard time ignoring the tickles. Shim Shim is tickling up, down, and all around and shows no sign of stopping. <laughs> oh, Clam can't take it in and... <laughs> the Clam is open, folks! The Clam is open! Now it's all up to Grippy to finish this. Here it comes! <laughs> you did it, Shim Shim! Great job! Now back in the pack. Shim shim. It's all up to Grippity now. <gasps> I have legs again! Thank you, Grippity. I knew you could do it. Good to have you back, Griselda. It's good to be back with all my friends. Now can we get back to celebrating Friendship Day up on the beach? I'm still a little nervous under the sea. Just a second. Griffity? For you, Griffity. You've earned it, my friend. <laughs> Thanks for the great ride, Saba. Now back in the pack. <laughs> what a great friendship day. We all really stuck together like good friends do. <laughs> Okay, okay, stop it now. Okay, yeah. <laughs> We're friends, I know. Cut it out now. <laughs> I think the best thing is that Griselda started a new tradition for Friendship Day. I did? <laughs> Make a new friend. Yep, I am pretty awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so Griselda. A snoozy sleepover. Worthy opponent, Master Pillow. We will meet again. Who's ready for a yummy surprise? 
Kitty Natty Ninja Cats are always ready for surprises. Ta-da! Oh. Popped Peppy Peppers? That's like my fourth favorite snack. After, of course, Fishy Poof Crackers, Fishy Poof Crackers with Zesty Cheese, and Limited Edition Extra Light Poof Fishy Poof Crackers. Hold it. Popped Peppy Peppers? Check. Suzuni Juice Balls? Check. Bendy Straws? Uncheck. <laughs> Thanks, little helpers. And check. There, everything's ready for the sleepover. Okay, back to snacking. Oh, bendy straws. I feel like a princess. <laughs> you never know when a real princess might show up. I'm here. Griselda! <laughs> It wouldn't be a party without you. I know. Where's Fruki? Fruki Kids is right here. <laughs> Care for an ice cold Zazuni juice? Yes, please. But would you happen to have a bendy straw? So thoughtful of you, True. Hello, party people. So far, so good. Everything's going just as planned. Now we're just waiting on the Rainbow King. That must be him now! Welcome, Rainbow King! Huh? Your Majesty? What? Uh, oh, <laughs> a lovely lavender evening to you, True and Bartleby. I'm so excited about your sleepover. I was just making sure I didn't forget anything important. Like my blankie or my pillow. Or, uh, hmm. Oh, and, uh, hey, if you need a toothbrush, I got lots. Oh, there's my tail cleaning brush. I was looking for that. Works like a charm. And I found my gum. Bubble chew. Mm. You want some? Ew! No, thanks. No, it's not a toothbrush. I've got one of those. Oh, what could it be? Don't worry, Your Majesty. We've got everything you could possibly need. Purple persimmons! True, your particular predisposition to planning is perfection personified. What he said. Thank you, Rainbow King. Please, come in. Rainbow King, welcome to you. Well, that's it. Everybody's here. Check. Next up, party time! <laughs> We're down to our very last party plan. Aww. Aww. A delicious Nummelberry pancake breakfast in the morning! Yay! All right, everybody, let's get ready for bed. I just remember what I forgot to remember. My Moo Moo. I always have my Moo Moo with me at bedtime. Moo Moo? That's not on my list. Can you sleep without it? Well, it has helped me sleep every night for the last three or four hundred million years. But I'm sure I'll be fine. I'll just count little helpers <laughs> until I fall asleep. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, six million four hundred and six. Wait, oh, I 
skip one. I'll start over. One, two. Rainbow King, do you want me to get your moo moo for you? It's no problem. Goodness, greenness, no. We'd have to go all the way to the royal greenhouse for my moo moo. That is pretty far to go. Uh, not to worry, True. I'll fall asleep soon. Okay. If you need anything, just ask. Good night, Rainbow King. Good night, True. Oh, blue bother. I mustn't keep everyone awake. I really don't like using sleeping spells. I, I, I can't remember why. Uh, but maybe just this once. Starry Blue, help me snooze. <sighs> I'm feeling snoozy already. <laughs> What a lovely summer rain, so refreshing. Bartleby, you're talking in your sleep again. So are you. <sighs> Fruki, you're flying! Huh, what? <gasps> True, look out! <sighs> What's going on? <gasps> Fruki kittens? Fruki! Oh, Fruki Wongons, come down! It's okay, Fruki Snuggles. You're safe with me now. Yes, you are. I definitely didn't plan for this. They're sleep floating. Fascinating. I've read about it. I never thought I'd see it in person. We should pull them down. No, don't touch him. If you do, you'll sleep float too. Can we wake them up? Guess not. <laughs> well, we can't just let them float around bumping into things. We need some rope. Or string. <laughs> or a butterfly net. Or a string. Or a super long straw. <laughs> or or string. string. Good work, little helpers. Wait, where's the Rainbow King? He's there, going out the window. <laughs> Rainbow wake King, up, please wake, wake up! up. Oh, Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! We need to catch up to him and wake him up. Oh, Cumulo! <sighs> Sorry to wake you, Cumulo, but we've got to go save the Rainbow King. Oh, wait. I forgot to get changed. Um, do we need to get changed, too? Nope. Keep your PJs on. <laughs> We're still having a sleepover. I've just got to be ready for action. Good idea. Can you two take Griselda and Fruki back inside? <laughs> Thanks, little helpers. <gasps> the entire metropolis is sleeping. Yeah, but Z, everyone in Rainbow City will sleep float right out of town. We need some wish help. And quick. To the wishing tree, please, Cumulo. <laughs> Z, where are you? I need your help. Uh, True, I'm right behind you. Oh, right. Sorry. Okay. We need something bright to find Rainbow King and something to get the citizens down. Something sticky. This is sticky? Um, no thanks. And we need something loud to wake everyone up. If he wakes up too suddenly, maybe everyone will fall down. Right. I didn't think of that. So, uh, pillows! But everyone's still floating, so we do need something sticky. Tape? Glue! No, hair gel. Ugh, Z. We need wishes. You're right. We do need wishes. Let's sit and have a think. <sighs> OK, 
Okay, True, how can the Wishing Tree help you? Well, we don't know what will happen if we wake up the Rainbow King suddenly. The other sleep floaters might wake up too. And then fall down. So we'll have to bring everyone down safely first. Good thinking, True. And when everyone is down safely, we'll gently wake up the king and he can break the spell. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> Wishing tree, share with me. Tiny wishes, one, two, three. Snuggly. Wishing tree, please share with me. Aloha. Magic power for you and me. Hello. Magic power in a wishing tree. True, these wishes are incredible. I can't wait to see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Snuggly. Snuggly. Snuggly's a blanket wish that can go big enough for lots of people to take a nap on. And if you sing a lullaby, it'll act like a magnet to anyone who's asleep. You'll be perfect for gathering everyone and keeping them safe and sound. <laughs> Your next wish is Woe Glow. Woe Glow! Woe Glow is a light wish. You are exactly what we need on a dark night. <laughs> and for your last wish, Poingy, the bouncing wish. Poingy, Poingy. Poingy is great at bouncing on its own. <laughs> yeah, it's a cat thing. It's what I do. <laughs> oh. Or you can jump onto it to bounce extra high. I'm not sure how a bouncing wish can help, but I'm sure we'll think of something. <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Come on, everybody. We've got to go save the Rainbow King. <laughs> but this is way too many sleep floaters. I agree. It's going to be very hard to find the Rainbow King in this mess. I have an idea. Take us down to the park, please, Cumulo. <laughs> Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Snuggly. Wish come true. Ready, Snuggly? Snuggly. Z, you said singing a lullaby makes Snuggly a magnet for anyone who's asleep, right? That's right. Well, let's get humming. Na na na, na na na, na 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 here comes the Rainbow King! Uh-oh! Rainbow King put Snuggly to sleep! Snuggly's losing its power! Rainbow King! We need to do something, or he'll float away with everyone! That would not be good. I can barely see him now. Huh? Who could be calling at this hour? <gasps> Rainbow King! Momo. He must have pocket bubbled me. Wake up, Rainbow King! Wake up, please! It's no use. Oh, Rainbow King, if only you could tell us what's wrong. Oh, Momo. It, even just a clue. Momo. Two word phrase. You know, that points us in the right direction. Momo. Yeah, like that. Momo. That's what's wrong. Rainbow King always has his Moo Moo at bedtime, and he can't settle down without it. That's why he's sleep floating. We've been doing it all wrong. Instead of waking him up, 
We need to help him have a good night's sleep. Of course. More sleep is the answer to our sleep problem. Yeah, I knew that. Yeah. All we have to do is get Rainbow King his Moo Moo. Cumulo! Come on, Bartleby. What? What? what, what go, go, Cumulo! To the Rainbow Castle! Okay, on a scale of one to dark, this is dark. How are we gonna find our way? I mean, I don't have that cat's can see in the dark thing. It's always been a great disappointment to me. I remember my mother once. Bartleby? Oh, sorry. Time for my second wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Woe Glow. <laughs> wish come true. You're up, Woe Glow. <laughs> Rainbow King said his moo moos in the royal greenhouse. This way. Here's the greenhouse. Hmm. Maybe the moo moo is some kind of plant. But there's gotta be millions of them. How are we gonna know which one is which? Fortunately, every plant is clearly labeled. All right. Let's go look for the moo moo plant. Okay, moo moo plant, uh, moo moo plant. Hmm. Well, I mean, it's not this one. True! Wait for me! Not this one. It's not this one either. Or this one. <laughs> Maybe it's that viney one over there. Nope, not over here. Where is it? Hmm. Ah! Guys, look! Is that the Rainbow King? He's floating way too far. We need to find that Moo Moo fast. Oh, we've just looked everywhere, and there's nothing. Nothing but this giant flower pot. <gasps> This must be it! True, shine the light over here. It's the Moo Moo plant. The fruit of the Moo Moo plant gives off a soft glow and a gentle hum. That is helpful for sleeping. So, where's the fruit? Way up there. Now I understand why the wishing tree gave me Poindy. Here, Z, can you hold Woglow? It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Poingy! Wish come true! Okay, Poingy, let's bounce. Poingy! Ready? Let's bounce, bounce, bounce! Go, Poingy, go! Higher, Drew, higher! It's just out of reach! Ugh. How are we gonna get it, True? I've got an idea. Bartleby, I need some kitty natty help. I see where you're going with this, True. Let's try this again, Poingy. Uh. I'm very proud of myself. Thanks for your help, Poingy. Poingy! You too, Woglow. <laughs> Zoo Zip Zap wishes in my pack. Okay, let's bring the Rainbow King his Moo Moo. Come on, Cumulo. be tricky. If Rainbow King touches me and makes me sleep float, it's up to you two to save the Rainbow Kingdom. Ha! No pressure! Rainbow King! I have your Moo Moo! <laughs> the Rainbow King isn't sleep floating anymore! His Moo Moo must have broken the spell! <gasps> and look! It's working! All the sleep floaters are floating back home to their beds. We did it! Woohoo! We did it! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Snuggly. You were super helpful. 
Tuck yourself back in the pack now. Uh, let's go home. I'm sleepy. Sleepy? But we're just getting started. We just saved this whole town. Let's celebrate! <laughs> Phew, what a night. My sleepover didn't exactly go as planned. Yeah, but you saved the kingdom, True. You're my hero. <laughs> and don't forget, we still have Nummelberry pancakes to enjoy in the morning. You're right. This was a pretty good sleepover after all. Just for you. Thanks for saving everyone in Rainbow City. And you, you remembered how much I love bendy straws. Oh, thank you, True, for bringing my Moo Moo. Aw, thanks, everyone. Mmm, 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 that is so good. Bartleby, you've got to try some. <laughs> Best <laughs> pancakes. <laughs> Ever. Mm, so delicious. Mm. 